<laughs> Watching the sunrise? Yeah. Nice. That's working. Always working. Good morning everyone. We have arrived in LA. We've got 10 days in San Francisco and the plan for today... Oh look, that's pretty much my name. Can you see it? If you didn't know, my uh, full name is actually Catherine. So that was pretty near my name. Wait, you just said we've got 10 days in San Francisco. Did I? Yeah, we, 10 days in <laughs> we, haven't, we haven't got 10 days in San Francisco. We've got 10 days in California. We're going from LA, we're doing a little drive up the Pacific coast and then going to San Francisco. And then we've got my friend's wedding over in Tahoe. So, McDonald's is open. Brilliant, McDonald's is open in case you were wondering. Um, but the plan for today is that we're gonna go and meet up with Sydney. I'm actually gonna do her podcast, which I'm really excited about because I love her podcast. Um, and then that's it. I don't really know what the rest of the plans for the day are, but we'll take you along with us. It's very hard not to say the names as you walk past them, isn't it? Mary Kate and Ashley share a star. Bradley Spears! I just read her book. Is that it? Am I doing it? I think it's out of focus. Oh. This yeah. is Sydney, you hey, all know that. Hello, <laughs> we just filmed her podcast together. But you need to see it because it's so bad, the space. <laughs> you need to see it because it's so bad. Well, the space is like, I, I dragged that couch right there. Yeah. I dragged it into here and then I faced you in this chair. And I sat in that corner over there. Super the only reason we use this room though is because they do have a little bit of soundproofing. Where did it go? Okay, I look like an idiot. Well, it now. once had soundproofing. Okay. <laughs> but yeah. We just filmed her podcast, and by her I mean Sydney. Um, so hopefully that will be up fairly soonish. Do you think? I'm gonna put it up on Monday. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that will be up before this goes up. So perfect. You can go and listen to that. <laughs> so finished doing the podcast with Sydney, and now Anton and I have come to Melrose Avenue to do a little bit of shopping, browsing in vintage shops, getting some inspiration for future collections. Get some, collections. Lunch. Get some lunch, that is what we're gonna do next. So yeah, we're just gonna go for a little stroll and see where we find something for lunch. What do you fancy? No idea. No? Not good though. Nice. That jet lag is finally hitting in. What time is it at home right now? I don't know. It is, let's think of it's two, it's about no, 10 p.m. 12, I think it's about 12. No, it's about 10 p.m. I think. And I, eight hours before. Yeah, two plus eight. 10. Quick maths. Right, should we cross? <laughs> I just filmed a whole few minutes of talking and I wasn't actually filming so that's brilliant isn't it anyway we've got back to our hotel now and I just wanted to show you how cool the views are from our rooftop because we've literally got 360 degrees 360 degree views um, so if I start over here so we've got the Hollywood sign in the distance over there we've got Anton and then if we look this way we've got views over downtown and then this way we have people doing a photo shoot so I won't really show you that and then this way looks out towards I guess Santa Monica and well the sea basically and then we are staying on sunset so there we have sunset down there it's a good little spot and obviously this isn't sponsored or anything but I will put the the link to where we're staying in the description just in case anyone's interested because it is a really nice little spot they're in yeah do you like it here i do yeah. i don't think the camera could hear you oh, you're you a filming? mumbler filming eh? filming you yeah first impressions of los angeles first impressions of la i'm not sure well i guess first impression i don't <laughs> I don't even know what i'm talking about anymore are you tired my eyes are tired, yeah. 
Yeah. Did you enjoy Melrose today? Yeah, Melrose is is my spot so far. So far of like the, the three <laughs> spots you've been to. That's where I would be. That's where you'd find me on Melrose. <laughs> what are we doing now? Going to the beach. Yeah. Tonight we're gonna go to the beach to see Mickey and some of her friends. Oh, that's the observatory up there. Look. Can you see right in the distance? Like, oh, oh, there it is. <laughs> Hello! On Monday actually, in a couple of days time, we're gonna do the hike from the observatory to the Hollywood sign. The observatory is actually shut on Monday so we won't go into there but we'll still do the hike. Look at this sunset, I mean it's not even the best of LA's sunsets but it's just still so nice. Just wanted to show you very quickly what I bought today when we were on. Melrose Avenue, we went to a shop called RCN Strict Studio. I can't actually read that, I'm just going to show it. And essentially the stuff in there was lots of vintage stuff that they had customised in some way. So for example, the top of this shirt, jacket, I guess it's a shirt, um, is Harley Davidson. don't know if you can see that there. And then the middle bit is taken from some kind of Czech shirt. And then the bottom part is from a Levi's shirt. So I think that's really cool. Um, and I like that as you go down, so like the top bit is poppers and then you've got buttons and then different buttons on the Levi's section at the bottom. I also just really like the cut of it, how it's like longer at the back, short at the front. Anyway, just wanted to show you that. I'm not going to show you the apartment right now because it is a little bit of a mess. Um, also, where I had my mole removed, got a spot underneath it, like underneath the scar, and I just popped it, and that was a big mistake because now it's looking not great. Whoopsies! Yeah. She has a chopping board. I know, I just can't believe it. Excuse me, can I get another cappuccino? Yeah. Do you have any particular notes? Oh, please. Yes. Do you guys want to the morning with Mickey. Oh, that's, that's not good. That's a big shadow in my face. That in particular doesn't look great, does it? So, I haven't actually talked to the camera today, but we went to Manhattan Beach this morning. We had breakfast with Mickey, and then we had a walk along the beach and browsed the shops a little bit. And now Anton and I have come to Santa Monica for sunset. I mean, you can't tell because it's all blown out behind me, but it's gonna be a nice sunset tonight. This is actually like one of my favorite places to come in LA where all of like the rings and bars and all of that lot is but for some reason now I feel a little bit intimidated to try and train like I kind of wanted to do a little bit of training but yeah don't feel that confident to just start training for some reason even though I used to come here all the time and train and didn't think about it at all but there we go maybe I'll do something in a bit Not even sure of any of that filmed on here, but just filmed a little Instagram reel. <laughs> Decided to come down to the water to do it because it was just too awkward trying to train around all the other people training. Actually, no, it wasn't just that. I tried to train on the bar. I did a swing gainer 
and the bar was super slippery and I don't have any chalk with me so I was just like meh whatever and there was a huge queue for the rings so yeah and it's so pretty down here look Like, is that not just perfect? I love it. I have to excuse that I'm slightly out of breath. Yeah. I have been walking for a solid seven on? minutes. Yeah, I think my mic's on. Yeah, it is. Um, today, we've decided to do the hike from the Griffiths Observatory to the Hollywood sign. And we had the option to do a slightly longer dirt route or the easy paved route, <laughs> which is only meant to be a two hour round trip. And obviously we decided to do that one. <laughs> yeah. Because we're not very good at walks and hikes. And it's just got really hot. It has. Imagine trying to do this in the summer. Yeah. It's literally like mid-November. Impossible. So it's pretty cool by LA standards. Not for my standards. Not for our standards. We are not very good in the heat. <laughs> um, but worth it for these views. It's already, so, I mean, to be honest, we don't even need to walk because we've already got the views already seen the sign, been to the observatory, look you can see the observatory there in the distance. Oh, did I miss? There. <laughs> Real smooth. Yeah, so we'll just go on a little walk, we'll hopefully find a nice viewpoint to make a little Instagram reel of some sort. I don't know where that cut out but my battery just ran out but fortunately I did pack a spare today. Not like me, but there we go, well prepared. Uh, what I was saying is that we're going to find somewhere en route to film a little Instagram reel of some sort. Probably do a little flip, although can I be bothered to do a flip? Maybe it'll just be a photo. <laughs> We've actually gone a little bit off piste now, so now we are on more of an actual trail track rather than just walking along a road. Uh, but we've decided that rather than trying to hike directly to the sign, we're going to try and hike as much as we can sort of in front of the sign to get a better photo of it. Because also you can't really get to the sign anyway, you can only get to behind it. Which I think might be a bit anticlimactic. I mean I've actually done that before and it, yeah, it's just not, it's not actually all that exciting. So I think it's better to try and hike to in front of it so we can get some nice photos. Is it filming? Filming. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> oh. Come and get in it. Be back here. Oh yeah, perfect. We made it. <laughs> Okay, we've certainly done a lot of walking today and we're quite, quite exhausted, honestly. Anton's a little bit grumpy. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna go and get some lunch and since we've got here, honestly, I didn't have flies flying around me on the way up, but now I'm sweaty, they're like all buzzing around me, it's kind of gross. Um, since we got here, Anton's been saying that he wants to go to In-N-Out and I know you can't exactly like exercise off a bad diet, but we figured that, oh no. 
I wonder how long my mic hasn't been plugged in for. Nightmare, let me just go and check. I think it was actually working, even though it was like half hanging out. Might have just um, had like half the, half the volume. Maybe it will just be half the volume, but I think it'll be fine. Um, yeah, I know you can't exactly exercise off a bad diet, but if we're gonna have pancakes, chicken and waffles for breakfast. Chicken and waffles. I mean, honestly, such an unhealthy breakfast, but we had to do it while we're here. And if we're gonna do in and out on one day as well, we might as well make it the day when we've done a lot of walking. <laughs> Um, so that's what we're gonna do for lunch, a very unhealthy eating day for us. But you have to every once in a while, don't you? Look, we did all of these little, oh, all of these little turns, do, 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 all the way around the other side. So naughty. <laughs> Are you happy? Yeah. Just tell me you blow your nose. <laughs> so Anton's gone for the double double and I've just gone for double, double. the cheeseburger. Right. I don't know, it kind of looks, oh no it is double. Yours is double, that's yours. <laughs> and I've got myself a strawberry shake and Anton's got, was it a Dr Pepper you got? Yeah, but then I just got pink lemonade. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Freezing in there. Yeah, it was. Just for the workers, so. though. Yeah. So, what's the verdict? The verdict. Yeah. The verdict for In and Out. Mm -hmm. Um, it, it was all right. It was good. Better than McDonald's, but not as good as Five Guys. There we go. Not as good as Five Guys, everyone. You've heard it here first. Yeah, so Five Guys is uh, still the reigning champ for, what do you call it? Fast food. Fast food burgers. Fast food burger Fast chain. Food. Yeah. Five In and Out was no match. But better than McDonald's. Yeah. Nice. Well, what should we do now? I'm not sure. I'm so tired. Maybe Rodeo Drive. Maybe, but should we go back and get changed? Go and shower and change. Sun's gonna set soon. A couple of hours. Right. Rodeo. See ya. Just like you. morning and today we are starting our road trip up the coast towards San Francisco. We're gonna stop this morning in Santa Barbara I think for breakfast and then potentially a little town called Salang which kind of feels like a little European town or village even looking at the photos and then we're gonna stay one night in Pismo Beach and then travel further up and we've got another night in Santa Cruz before we get to San Francisco. But I thought just before we leave, I would quickly show you this apartment. It's still a little bit of a mess, but less messy than it was when we were living in it. So let me just start at the door where you come in. So when you come in, you've got this nice little kitchen area here, dining table set up, a bit of our mess on the floor that doesn't come with the apartment. Lovely sofa, honestly, I thought that this sofa was one of those that looks really nice, but wouldn't be that comfy, but it was super comfortable and nice big TV. What we really liked was having this little balcony out here where we would come and sit in the morning. Oh, okay, here you go. So this is our little balcony area that we had with such a nice view. And you can actually see the Hollywood sign from the balcony and heading back in. Oh, he's back from the car. Um, through here you've got the bedroom. Bed's not made properly because I figured they're about to strip it anyway. And 
a lovely little bathroom. Yeah, and we really liked the location of where we were staying. It was very easy to get to everywhere we needed to go. So as I said, I'll I'll put a link below to where we stayed. I'll, in fact, I'll link all of the places that we stay on this trip. Not that any of them were paid for. None of this video is sponsored. Obviously, I mean, who would sponsor these videos right now? It's not like they get many views. Um, but yeah, just wanted to show you because we really enjoyed staying here. And if you guys are coming to LA, you might too. Anyway, should we get on the road? Yeah. Come on then. Go on, you do an impression of me. But that's not how I do it. <laughs> that's a bit more like it. <laughs> what a banger. Right, we have just got to Solvang. I think earlier when I said about this place, I called it Solang. I might have, or I might have called it Solvang. But we had a nice little stop off in Santa Barbara, had a nice breakfast. We had Huevos Rancheros, is that how you say it? No idea. No idea. And then we went for a little stroll, just like into the main shops area. And that was it. And now we're here in Solvang gonna go and sit somewhere and have something to drink i'm really thirsty super super thirsty so yeah oh my gosh a wasp is right outside the window oh um but yeah another little stop off anything you want to add are you grumpy because you're a melanid <laughs> i'm not literally i just asked him to pass me the microphone and he wasn't passing it but he also wasn't saying anything I'm like, it's not like he hasn't heard me. He's just not responding. I'm like, are you ignoring me? He's like, just because I didn't respond doesn't mean I'm ignoring you. I'm like, well, it does actually. That's exactly what it is. No, it doesn't. It does. You gotta let things go. That's you what you gotta do. Me. You drive me insane. You gotta let things go. Shut up. That's what you gotta do. Oh, so annoying. Right, gonna go now and go for a little wander, but I'll probably film a little montage thing for you guys. Creepy. Oh, look, they've got a little mermaid. <laughs> but this name, though, you try and bite me. I'm trying to bite you. Um, please stop it. Maybe I will put it in the vlog, everyone will see what a weirdo you are. So we're only here for one night, but it's a nice little pit stop on our route. I think we're gonna go for a little walk along the coast now. And then, oh, we actually, we've got some vouchers for a couple of restaurants, so microwave, maybe- Microwave popcorn. Microwave popcorn, how cute. We'll go for a walk and then we'll go and eat at one of the places that we have a little- I fancy a beer. For. I fancy a beer, do you know what I fancy? a real American beer. I fancy a real Italian Aperol spritz. <laughs> Should we go? Yeah. Come on. Are they pelicans? Uh, I'm not sure actually. I think they might be pelicans, but... Oh, yeah, that big one is. Yeah. They're the ones that have like the... Yeah, the big one is. Yes. Yeah. <gasps> are they the seals? They are. Oh. Or sea lions or something. There's like... Oh, I'm not going to be able to see on this camera. They're too far away. Right. You're really not going to be able to see them on here, but... Around here. Seals. Or sea lions or something. Come on. This is the backdrop, by the way, to where we are. Do 
it's kind of giving small town vibes but it's quite cute and the woman who checked us into the hotel was really really lovely Beaked you with my beak. Well, I knew you were going to go in for a kiss. <laughs> you know it. You, you absolutely love it. <laughs> you love a peg on camera. I do love how in a lot of places in California the houses are so different on the same street. It's just kind of, kind of cool. That'd be quite cool, just living there. You just watch sunset every day. Yeah. At least you've got the best view. So nice. Where we're staying is technically just actually round the corner, not round the corner, round the cove. What do coast. we call that? Coast. No, coast. Along the coast. It's along the coast from Pismo Beach. Um, so we're going to wander around there. It's about a, about a half an hour walk because there's more food options there for dinner. Just looking for somewhere to eat now. Just looking for somewhere to have some dinner. Maybe have a little drink, a little beverage, and then we'll head back to Shell Beach Inn, which is where we're staying. Super fishy. Does smell very fishy around here. Smells like the seaside. Good morning. I'm Good gonna actually, morning. I'm gonna just clean the screen. Hang on. Yield. Yield. I don't think I actually spoke to camera yesterday. We had a long travelling day, which was made longer by the fact that. Oh, whoa. Where are we going? Um, it was made longer by the fact that we had driven down Route One, which is like the the coastal road, and we finally got to a place where it said that the road was closed and we couldn't go any further and we had to go back an hour on ourselves to get to the nearest exit to get onto route 101 and go a different way two hours extra so an extra two hours onto our already i think it was about four and a half hour journey so that's fantastic we stopped last night in santa cruz which is where we are right now we didn't get to see any of Santa Cruz because when we got in it was dark because of our additional time on our journey. So just seeing it now as we drive back out of it. We didn't have the best night stay because the hotel that we were staying at, the walls were super thin, or not even the walls, the ceiling was super thin so we could hear everything from the room above us, like every footstep they took. It just wasn't a very nice. It, it just wasn't the best. I'll link it below anyway because I said I'd link everywhere that we stayed but wouldn't necessarily highly recommend that one. I mean, the views this morning, like waking up, like you're looking out onto the beach, so that's lovely. <coughs> and it was fairly reasonably priced, so can't complain too much, but it was very loud. <laughs> and now we are making our way to San Francisco. Today we'll arrive in San Francisco. We're gonna get some coffee. We're gonna go get some coffee. We're gonna get a cup coffee. of joe. Coffee, get a cup of joe. Is a cup of joe a coffee or a cup of juice? No, it's coffee. Oh, is it? A cup of joe. A cup of joe? Yeah, coffee. We'll go get a cup of joe. Um, yeah, so we're going to go and get a cup of joe. <laughs> Doesn't have the same effect if you say a cup of joe. Um, and then we're going to head to San Francisco. I think I'm probably going to end the vlog in San Francisco because at that point I'm going to be with my friends and we're there for my friend's wedding. So. Yeah, I'm not gonna vlog the wedding, obviously. <laughs> so this will probably be the last day of the vlog. Is there anything we did yesterday that's worth mentioning? Oh, we went to Hearst Castle, which was nice. Did you enjoy Hearst Castle? Yeah. 
Yeah, it was really stunning actually. It's quite funny though, like how it's not actually that old. Yeah, I think and it was something like a cinema room and stuff. Yeah, it was something like 104 years old, and obviously in the USA that's a very old building. Whereas in the UK, like I grew up in Windsor, and Windsor Castle is like 900 and something years old. So it's just quite funny when places here are like, oh, this is a really old castle and you're like it's 100 years old like tennis courts and uh... it was an amazing place though like really stunning yeah. so i'm sure i will have inserted lots of footage from yesterday of that oh we stopped in morrow bay for breakfast it was funny because i was like oh i think i'm gonna not have such an unhealthy breakfast day because we haven't been eating the best while we've been here because we're in america because we're in america um so i thought i'd go for the eggs and you know do like eggs and fruit salad or something and i did order the, e order the eggs but it came with two blueberry muffins so naturally i had to eat the blueberry muffins <laughs> but yeah we had breakfast at morrow bay which is nice um and that's it now we're on our way to san fran see you there <laughs> The white man. So we made it to San Francisco, we've dropped our stuff off at the hotel and we thought we'd go out on a little wander. We, some wanna, food. we had some really nice Vietnamese food, too much actually, we could have literally just got could away have with it. We've had some more those garlic noodles. No, literally we could have just ordered the starters and that would have been more than enough. But we also got a main each as well, and we're absolutely stuffed. So, we're now gonna wander towards the Golden Gate Bridge, try and get a photo there. I mean, if you've only got one day in San Francisco, I feel like you at least need to get a photo. Have you done it before? I've never been here before. Have you? No. Nope. So, yeah, we're gonna go and walk. It's about an hour and a half walk to the Golden Gate Bridge, get a photo. And that's probably where I'll end this vlog, to be honest. But I hope you've enjoyed it. What's been your highlight of the trip? Uh, those garlic noodles. Brilliant. Anton's highlight of the whole trip to California was some Vietnamese garlic noodles. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Got some serious hat hair there. How much further is the walk? 56. 56 minutes, oh my goodness. Should we cross? We're gonna go that way. We're gonna go that way. Where is it? You actually can't see it, can you? Look at that. No. Can't see it. You zoomed in. Zoom in. Oh, there it is. <laughs> there it is. If you look into the distance, you can see Alcatraz over there and then obviously if we look this way oh you just see a bush no if you look this way there's anton <laughs> and golden gate bridge um all right so i think i'm gonna end this vlog here i would personally like to walk a little bit close to the bridge but anton has given up look He sat on that bench, he's like, I'm not going any further. Look. <laughs> Little grump. Um, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed following us along on this little California trip that we've been on. And I'll see you in the next one, whenever that may be. What is on my arm? Oh my goodness, I've got fluff stuck to me. Ow. What an ending, eh? <laughs> see you next time, guys.